let's see the best possible setting for BGMI, set CPU to 6 core and RAM to 8 GB, and by the way I am use Bluestacks 64 bit, that why I am able you use more RAM and CPU, that why if you have 32 bit, then you have to reinstall your Bluestacks and download 64 bit version, and then set performance mode to high, and frame rate to max, and off these two setting. You can turn on show FPS if you want, but I will not recommend you because it creates a psychological stress that your FPS are low and you can't take fight even when your FPS is high. And in display setting, set display resolution to 720p for best key mapping and aim and set your DPI to 160 for best performance and zero frame drop and use Bluestacks cursor and in graphics, set graphics engine mode to performance and graphics render to up and bland, set interface render to auto and set ASTC texture to hardware decoding, it's gone better in some recent updates so you can use this and tick this graphics card in use and set your voice and sound devices as you want and in preferences off all setting except for this and in phone set Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra, not S21 or S22, set it S20 Ultra and set network Vodafone and in user data, try to clean this in at least in one month and in advance off all this because it's caused sudden ping spikes and always update your Bluestacks to prevent them. Hello guys. If you also want to hit I tool shot like this. I need a weapon. And want to surprise your enemies like this in the clip that Then here it is, to hit iTool you need to first set up a key mapping. To set up a key mapping, first you have to follow these steps and watch the video till the end, so first go to layout and set layout to 3 number, I know you will ask why, because in 1 and 2 number layout, you can use the joystick without even clicking on joystick, but it's not the case with 3 number layout, you cannot use it outside the radius of the joystick, so it cannot interfere with other buttons. So first go to your controls and set the I button, exact center of your crosshair, and then go to your key mapping, and grab the same pan shooting button, and place in the center, but little upward of your screen, and a and set X and Y to 70%, then set key to F1. Then see a little setting icon there, and click on it, a menu will appear, and tick these both. And grab this fire button from here and place on your fire button. Then grab this I button and place on your I tool and set Alt key for this and I tool only works with Alt key, that why set Alt key not any other key. And for the Jonathan Jiggle first go to your controls and set the joystick size to 130 and set the sprint button to as close as possible and the sprint sensitivity to 100%, then go to key mapping and grab the D-pad and place it on your joystick, then see a little setting icon there, click on it, a menu will appear, then set the activation time to 1, and set the joystick speed to 10,000, and place your pad on exactly in the center of the joystick, it should be exactly in the center, otherwise your character will glitch backward, forward like this, and this will totally messed up your movement. After this your movement will be like Jonathan. Now how to hit a eye tool shot, to hit eye tool shot you have to aim on your target with the help of the eye tool, and to fire, just release the alt key, and starting clicking the fire button as many times, and as fast as possible and the trick will work, remember you have to do this in milliseconds, and this trick is only for beginner, if you want the best accuracy, you have to master the timing to release and fire milliseconds in just one click, which will take some time to master. And some people say their movement lags, the reason for this your bad key mapping, you should not put any keys inside the circle of D-pad, because the keys will start interfering when you press them, and you should not repeat your movement keys more than once, and sometimes your peak button will glitch like this. To avoid all this, you have to shift all your driving work to arrow keys, 
which you will only use for driving and flying glider, helicopter boats, etc. After this your key mapping will be smooth. Like butter, like criminal undercover. And after all done, click cloud sync button and click update. It will take some time and you are done and your movement and jiggle will be like this.